How's it going everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave and welcome back aboard the Nostalgia Train. So, if I start sending, bear in mind, I do have a little bit of a cold, so I apologize for that. One way or the other, I made, I checked to see if there was anything to do outside of going in there. Now, I don't know why I thought there was. There's not. So, just let's, 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 let's enter Dungeon 2. I think I said Dungeon 1 was the easiest dungeon in this game. No. This one's the easiest dungeon. That's flaming. If I totally flaming, boy. Like, we should totally go in there so hot. Oh, gosh. Of course, a heated up location is going to bring Karen out. Hello? Anybody in here? A bunch of rock is in here. No, I, I didn't mean to push that. I pushed a button and, and then something behind my head appeared and said skip. No, I'm not skipping. I'm surprised you can. But... Cut me, cut the grass. Descend it, de ooh. Ah. Well, I put me in 436 rupees. I kind of need more than that. Ah, oh, boy. You got anything else? No? Okay, well, lame. Ugh, that's just totally lame stuff. Die. Ah, oh, well, well, at least it gave me nothing. Wow. Uh, in Zelda, that's a sentence you generally don't hear me say. What's up here? Hello? Oh, a chest. I want that. I definitely want that. I was saying that just because it came out of my rear end, but yes, I definitely want that. Hey! Whoa. Hi. Ooh, Monster Claw. What time I got one of these? Hi. My partner's gone missing, and those red guys are everywhere. I never should have come here. No, really. Cobble, I never would have guessed that one. Oh, it's you again. Come all this way in search of your friend, eh? Yep. That reminds me, before I came in here, I saw a weird-looking blonde girl get dragged away. But don't even dream about going to the rescue. Those baddies are everywhere. If you want to live to live again one day, y y you should head for home, pal. Have you met me? Actually, the answer to that technically is yes, but that's not what I mean. Dig. Dig, 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 dig. No, no, stop it on the digging. No, 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 more digging, digging. Ow. Sheesh. I'm just totally flaming, big boy. Oh my gosh, Karen, shut up. That? Okay. Well, alright then. I probably should have hit this one second. Oh well. Come on. It ain't that hard to slice a wire. Actually, it should be. IRL, it should be. It should be that hard. There we go. Hello. What fee? Master, I am detecting new enemies ahead. They appear to be creatures of very significant physical ability. 
I know how to target, thank you. I definitely know how to call, but I'm not gonna do it. Ow! He just whipped me! <laughs> get, get flamed, big boy! <laughs> he just totally got flamed! Okay, time to dig. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted either. That's what I wanted. Alright, well. It should be a domino effect, right? Yep. Yep. Nice, nice stance there, Bubblehead. Uh, hey. They make it very easy to not fall in the lava here. I think they're supposed to make it more difficult than not. Hi! I didn't notice you, lad. I actually didn't. Bust! I must have dropped it earlier. Dropped what? Hi. Hey, nice timing, pal. It's me, lead. You showing up here me must mean we're connected somehow, you know? You know, like fate or something. Anyways, do me a favor and get my bomb bag, okay? I was behind that rock looking for treasure when those creeps showed up. I panicked and hit the road, but it looks like I dropped it. It's a bag for carrying around, but I could tell there's a reason we call it a bomb bag. I can't imagine not having one. Oh, hey. I guess I don't have to imagine it, because I lost mine. Heh, 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 shut up. Anyway, it's back there. Do me a favor and get my bomb bag back, will ya? If I must. But let's be honest, for game progression's sake, I must. Can I flame you too? Could you just go flame it away? That works. Enemies be flaming, bro. Like, oh my gosh. Let's go full out to see if I can find any chests. Uh, do, 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 do. Actually, I found these. This place is benefiting. Be benefiting? What the? We're gonna pretend that's a word. Okay. Let's try this again. There we go. That's what I was trying to do before. You know, just for two peepholes. Whoa, 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 whoa. You know what? Never mind. I, I was checking to see if the... <sighs> wow, that's a lot of money. <laughs> the more I dig, the happier I am. Diggy, 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 dig, 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 diggy, dig, diggy, dig, dig, dig. See? Digging makes me happy for some reason. I'm not even one of these thing, creature things, and it still makes me happy. I don't know what it is. Apparently, digging makes me bouncy, too. I'll just start saying the word dig, and I just start bouncing. <laughs> What's wrong with me? See, is there anything on the side over here? Uh, nope. Hey, buddies. Hi. Blah, to you, too. Can I throw you in the lava as well? 
Your friend actually kind of... Look, look. Your friend jumped in. Okay, you know what? Ow! Alright, come here. Hey! Ow! Okay, it's a good thing I have... Hey! I'm not the one supposed to... Actually, I'm totally flaming already. I didn't need that. That was not necessary, you know? I got a lizard tail. What is that gonna help me do? Hi! I'm not used to the final blows in this game! Are you serious? I did the thing that Woods should have done the final blow shenanigans and it didn't work. There. Doesn't matter. I, uh oh. You just had to put it in there, didn't you? Look, I'm already flaming enough as it is, okay? I don't need to be even more flaming. Even more flaming and it'll burst. You got the bomb bag. Now you can't carry bombs with you. There's a good chance you could get places you couldn't before. Yeah, no kidding. I can think of one off the bat. It's actually in the original place we were at. I'm not going to do that until later, but... Hi. Lead, I got your bag. I'm keeping it. Hey! You found my bomb bag! Sorry to put you through that. Guess I owe you one now. So let me have it. What's this now? You want to borrow it so you can go deeper into the volcano? Alright. You're looking for your friend. You sure have put yourself out there getting this far. That reminds me. How's my pal? Uh, worried. He's worried? About me? What kind of pal am I? Putting him through that. You must be worried too. Not knowing if your friend's dead or alive. Whoa! We don't need to go that far. I'm not letting you borrow my bag though. Nope! I'm giving it to you. Just don't blow yourself up. Thanks! Yeah, <laughs> we're doing this animation again. Now you've got my bomb bag. Go find your friend. Uh, thanks actually. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold up. I forgot to tell you something. What? No, oops. I'm assuming you thought that bag was empty. I accidentally skipped it. Actually, no, yeah, that is what he says. Knowing me, that bomb bag is pretty much empty. So here you go. Some extra bombs. Probably what he said. Anyway, if you run out of bombs, just find some more and fill the bag back up. When you've got a bomb flower, press... Yeah, I know. That bag can hold up to ten bombs. So if you run across bomb flowers, be sure to fill the bag. Okay. You mean like these? Like that. There we go. Um, I don't think there's anything else here to do, so let's go. At least in that section, there's a lot we need to do. A lot. First off, I'm going to pull out my sword and make sure everyone's flaming in the fire pit below me. If these things right here, they, they're pretending to be hot. These baths, those things... They're just pretending to be hot. They need to be flaming in the fiery pits of huh. It's not even the fiery pits of hell. It's the fiery pits of huh. <laughs> you didn't land in the fiery pits of huh. But I do want that.
Actually, I know what this wants me to do. What? Actually, I, I know why I messed up. Hold up. There we go. I definitely want that. <sighs> All right. What's in chest number three? I think this is the... Th I still want that anyway, but... It's just totally not as flaming as I thought it would be. Or I fall off the rock because I'm running too fast. Ah, no you don't. Give me that. I told you he was flaming. He was flaming with the power of blur. He was in the flames of the and flaming with the power of blur. What that means, I don't know, but I'm gonna say it anyway. Oh, Bluebird Feather. I don't think you get those very often. Or no, it's not those you don't get very often, it's something else. It's the other kind of feather, I forget what it's called though. I cut all the grass here, hoping for a lot of rupees. Probably not gonna get very many at this rate. Yeah. Apparently digging for rupees gets me more than cutting grass. Wow. Elden ore. Rupee. 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 Elden ore. Huh. Okay. Dope. Cool. Put your sword away. Actually, no. Take your sword out. Take your sword out. I saw that. I saw that. I want that. Totally flaming bird just gave me his money. This episode is just totally flaming so far. I should probably shut up before that. <laughs> that is not what I wanted. Whoa! I can't run back up the rock. I have to... This game makes perfect sense, yeah. Okay. Actually, you know what? I want to get rid of any possible um, chance of me not being able to progress first. I got a couple of things I want to do uh, before pushing forward, but... Hey, Balloon Butt. How's the flame in flames? <laughs> Does that count? <laughs> oh my gosh, that counts, right? That, that counted for something? Are they still dead? <laughs> that, was, that was actually kind of funny to watch. The flames totally got him, not me. It's the flames of the balls of fire. At this point, I don't even know what I'm saying. What, whatever words come to my mouth first are the words that Karen says. Pizza. No, that's Bob. Why do I always think of pizza when I try to think of something random? I look at my past videos, I'm like, uh... What's well, the first random word that'll come to my mind? Pizza. That's it. Is this totally a flaming object? You don't even know. Actually, good pizza can be pretty hot. Right there. Right there. Hey! You're supposed to blow up. Yes, like that. 
spending a lot of time on this ball. Wait. Okay, I was making sure there wasn't another section that I'm missing. Run for a bit. Stop. Run for a bit. Stop. No. Stop. You need to experience the flame. Oh, screw you, Karen. I made my character get hurt. Ow! Okay, then. Oops. There you go, Karen. Something went boom. You happy? Uh, no. I am never satisfied with that kind of stuff. Karen, you're never satisfied, period. You're the epiphany of what people call Karens nowadays. I feel bad for... Actually, now that I think about it, I feel bad for anybody who had, like, was given the name Karen prior to... Like, when people started using the name Karen for those who... act like Karens... Anybody who was given the name Karen before that, I feel bad for them. Oh. It's a... Glad I was already on a flat surface. Yeah. <laughs> Can I please land on the rock instead of in the lava? That's what I was trying to do in the first place. Yes, like that. That was not that hard to do. So why wasn't I able to do it? How did that not work? Hello? Bomb wall that's bombable. Yeah, it worked that time. Bad. Bad burning key. I'm already flaming enough as it is. I don't need to be more hot. Those flaming balls that those balloons spat out. They made me totally more flaming than you could possibly imagine. But now the guy's gotta get crushed, so... Now there are some people in the world who actually talk like that. I'm not trying to make fun of them, that's just kind of the developed character voice. I guess. Uh... Okay, that's just rude. That was unflippin' call for. You did not have to do that. Okay, wait. Well, that sort of kind of didn't do it, but, you know. Let's just go through this crevice. Well, cavern? Tavern? That's not a tavern. You can drink beer at a tavern. You can't drink beer in here. Oh, as you'd be able to find Bob in here. Oh, hey, Bob. And boom. There we go. And there's a save point up there, and I kind of don't want that because we're only partway through this tavern here. It must be a tavern. Bob's here. Must be drinking beer or something. Maybe he's giving something new. Maybe it's whiskey. <laughs> Freaking Bob. All right. Hi. How are you? Don't shoot any more flaming balls at me, okay? That's much more like it. Jeez. Didn't need those flaming balls to begin with. Get your mind out of the gutter. I mean, like, you know, little balls of fire. Fireballs. The things you see, like, in Mario, for example. You know, anybody who ever says get your mind out of the gutter before anyone says anything, I always assume... This is actually kind of why I brought it up. I always assume... It, 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 well, no. People who say that, you kind of would figure they're just assuming. And if they're assuming dirty things, they're thinking dirty things. You know, you could try to get away from me, but it just ain't gonna work. 
Bruh. Have fun in the flaming pool of death. <laughs> Actually, I'm totally cool with that. We're at, we started this episode with four, a little less than... What did we have? I think we had like... Actually, I think we started this episode with... I don't know. How many rupees did we start this episode with? I think it was like 423 or something like that. Hey, buddy. Hey, guess what? I got something for you. Ow! That wasn't... This wasn't part of the agreement. Hey. It's not enough. More. More. I was gonna say, how in the world are you supposed to... That's how. I don't think there are any more chests in here that you can actually pause. I stand corrected. Hello. Put down. No, I don't want... Link. Put it down. Pick it up. Raise it high. Throw it. <laughs> I mean, that works. Excuse me. That was not called for. All right, you know what? I get it. You're just getting me back for the bull crap I gave your brethren. Ow. Bro, you're lucky I have three fairies. Sheesh. Oh, and you gave me a heart. You know what? I'm cool with that. What's in here? This is not progress, but... Duh! Maybe it is. I don't know where you ended up, but I don't care. Why didn't he jump? That was weird. Link, come on, bro. You did it twi you did it twice already. Just do it a third time. Yeah, like that. Good job. Took you two tries, but you you know. Who knows what I'm talking about anymore? Those flaming balls just keep coming at me and it's infecting my brain cells. Ooh, what's in the hole? Actually, I want those. Glad I checked. But, of course... Oh, man. What is that sound? Actually, I think that's the son of a pig. You break the pots and give me nothing? Is this really RNG? what these pots give you, or are they literally filled with nothing all the time? I don't think I came in here the first time around. This must be the dungeon map. Yeah, okay. Did I seriously miss a room from beginning? Or are those just... I don't know. Let's find out. We're in the one of the rooms now. Um... I guess what it is is just these little sections are caverns. I didn't know that. Hmm. Okay. So, ignoring the second one. However, I missed some stuff in the first room that we could go get. They're not detrimental. Just a couple of pots and a uh, relic that is very common anyway. Um, eh, I'll leave it be. One thing I like about that move I just did is you can get enemies from behind. So that's appreciated. Please give me three. Hearts. Anything? I like digging, but not for nothing. Sheesh. Whew. That's a rupee. Duh. I don't 
don't need these. Is there another section at the Whoa, Okay. Uh, this digging is getting me a lot of nothing. Seriously? As I said, this digging is mainly getting me nothing. That relic is what I missed in the previous room. But there's so many of those that it's like, I don't think it matters whether you... How did you not land that? Oh gosh! <laughs> Climb all the way this time. There you go. There we go. I seem to just love getting flamed. Maybe Karen's right. Maybe things just do need to be flaming. Like, oh my god, you have no idea how right that is. Karen, go away. Who am I kidding? You've been here the entire episode. You might as well just stay the rest of it since there's like 10 minutes left. Okay. One heart. Two heart. Three heart. Emptiness works too. An empty hollow brain cell works too. Ugh. Actually, no, that doesn't work. That's, uh. I'd rather keep that in the brain. A lot of people don't understand what that part is for. But it's that. <laughs> it's to tell you hey, throw it here. It blends in with the environment too well. That's the problem. All right, run. Seriously, Link, stop half-assing it. Shoot, I was hoping, I was hoping, no. Okay. Oh, you need basically a full thing of it. Wow. Wow. Okay. Not even gonna lie, I was not expecting that. Let's just run our way to the top. Hey, would you look at that? It's a chest. I wonder what's inside this. Anybody's not able to tell what's inside that chest. They've got problems of their own. A dragon sculpture. It is carving. Uh, it is a carving of a coiled dragon made out of dazzling gold. Like, oh my god, it's so shiny. This is just turning into Karen's flame in episode. <laughs> Open wide. Be ah! Why'd you have to turn around? Why'd the camera have to turn? That works. That totally works, actually. That is totally fine. I don't mind that whatsoever. There's the boss door. More than 34 minutes. You know what? Let's finish this done. Jen. In this episode. Let's go. You just totally got this. It's in the bag. Okay, so... I think I may have mentioned this before, but what I find kind of funny... So it tells you to push down on both. The analog sticks. Nah, nah, I'm gonna push A. <laughs> you know, because that's the generic way to do it. It just snapped the gold thing in half. Can I have half of it? 
Preferably the bigger half. <laughs> Please. All right. Let's kick this guy's ass. Technically, I could go back if I wanted to, but we're already here. We might as well. That does not sound good. Okay. Master, I detect Zelda Zora in the surrounding area. I detect an especially strong reaction from this chain. I calculate the probability Zelda was bound by it recently at 95%. Well, she got away. I'm not surprised. I surmise Zelda was somehow able to escape and proceed along this path. I suggest we continue with all possible speed. All possible speed, you say? I'm not going to need these later anyway. Hello? Is there anyone here? Oh, ha, ha, ha. Hi. Hi, Ga I, hi, Garahim. I'm pretty sure everybody's given him that name <laughs> on this platform at this point. Oh, it's you! Let me see. No, that's not it. This is so very embarrassing. But I seem to be at a loss for your name. Not that it matters, really. To tell you the truth, I'm feeling a bit frustrated right now. And right now, I just need someone to vent to. This is too realistic, Gearham. I heard my underlings had finally captured the Spirit Maiden. So of course I rushed over here. What can I say? I was excited. Flustered, even. What did I find when I arrived? That agent of the goddess! She had once again... You see... What I'm trying to say is, just say it. That goddess-serving dog escaped with the girl. I must have the spirit made him in order to resurrect my master. I must have her. Okay, I get it. You ain't getting her though. I got a little carried away there, didn't I? Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Oh my god! Throw him in the pit of the, the pit of good. <laughs> Why do you keep calling it that, Karen? They're fire, what do you expect? It's just so hot in there. Why not just call it Dante's Inferno or something like why am I talking to myself? <laughs> I don't deal well with complications to plans I have laid out so carefully. It's a character flaw of mine. Ugh. But something good can c still come from this day. I've had all this bottled up anger smoldering inside me, and now I can release it. There's someone special I'd like you to meet. Oh, don't be shy. I need to vent all this unhealthy anger, and your agony is such a great stress reliever. Oh, screw you, Garaham. It won't take much more than a few moments with my friend. Before you're charred to a satisfying crisp. And let me tell you, that will put a spring in my step. Yeah, prepare to be disappointed. Good job, Link. That's actually the correct direction. Please tell me I have bombs. I mean, he's gonna cause me to go to the top anyway, but where there are bombs. High rock version of. Yeah. There you go, eat bombs. King Dodongo rock version. Whoa, okay, that was fast. Three hits and you're back up. 
Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's climb to the top where there are more. Actually, you'll probably hit that and climb down, won't you? Yeah. I'm just while you're while you're stupidly climbing this area, I'm just gonna. Whoa! Ow! Okay, that was just rude. It's just downright rude. Bro. That's right. Fall your way into the below abyss. Come on, dude. Seriously? I really hope this... Ow! This is not supposed to be hard. This is just me being stupid. Eat... Eat bomb! Alright, come here. Bro. Bro. Ha! Oh, you're making this so easy. Knock you to the bottom, butthole. bomb. Yeah, that's right. I mean, this guy is not hard at all. In the slightest. I mean, yes, he's totally flaming, but for, to what degree? Like, oh my gosh, just look at that flame. Okay, fine. Fine. You pull one of those? Ow. Oh, wow. You actually hit me. You actually did some damage. Bro, come on. At least do me the common courtesy of trying to be difficult. And, yeah. I'm kind of just letting him hit me at this point. Quite frankly, I don't care. I've got three fairies. This should do him in. Because all the rock is gone. Yeah. Come on! <laughs> that was ridiculous. And we're done here. That's it. <laughs> that took four minutes. And if it wasn't for Gearham's monologuing, that would have taken two. That's how easy this is. Good grief, game! Give me that. Ding! That's ten heart containers filled. Well, so, uh, it's four if you're not including the original six you start with. Time to go through the goddess door. Only to find basically nothing there. Again! Oh! I stand corrected. Zelda? Zelda? Hello? Am I some kind of invisible piece of sh to you? <laughs> Why is that when you turn around? Come on! You cannot go to him, Your Grace. Remember what we discussed. Restrain yourself. Focus on the task at hand. This is ridiculous. Impa, I will slice you in... Never mind. I'm not finishing that sentence. 
That's that's too morbid. I will slice you in half. What did I just say? I wasn't gonna say. Wow. Okay. This is pissing me off. I I had to go. I'm sorry, Link. <sighs> and let me guess. Knowing this character, now I'm getting scolded. Right? Now you're gonna turn around and scold me. Hey! What? It took you far too long to get here. Looking at you, I fear the goddess is mistaken in her choice of agents. If this failure is an indication you have no hope of defending her grace from those who seek the, to assail her. Do my words anger you, boy? Do my words sting? Let them. If I had not come when I did, your Zelda would already have fallen into the hands of the enemy. The truth of it is you were late. You were late and you failed to protect her. Oh, screw you! I sent Zelda ahead to learn more of the fate in which she is destined to play a part. Listen well, Chosen One. If you wish to be of help to her grace, you must summon a shred of courage and face the trials laid out before you. Only when you've conquered the trials will you be of use to Zelda. No sooner am I understood. Yes. At least you're being reasonable. I mean, that was kind of a dick thing to say at first, but at least that last thing you said is a bit reasonable. But that's basically the game going, don't save her yet. Far too early. And then you got Breath of the Wild. Eh, go ahead. We don't care when you do it. Okay. Well, time to strike this thing. Here, Fee rant about the goddess saying, Hey, go here next and leave. On this another lengthy episode, because for some reason, this series can't go without several lengthy episodes. Next time's a 30 minute one. There's just too much flame. Now we got ourselves some water to ease the flame in bits. Hi, Fee. Master, I have a message written in the language of the gods of old. Allow me to translate for you. From the edge of time I guide you, the one destined to carry out the goddess's mission. The spirit maiden who descended from the clouds has passed through the earth's spring and makes her way to a faded place. Okay. The parched desert of Laneru. That is where the Chosen will pass through the gate of time into a distant world. Okay. So we're basically going to the Temple of Time. Or at least as it is right now. How does the Temple of Time even exist at this point in time? You got the amber tablet. The weathered surface of this heavy stone tablet feels very odd. Hi, Zelda. At least you know she's alive now. Completely positive about it. Alright, can we go home now? It's almost... It, and you're gonna talk again. I know you are. Or maybe not. Okay, I guess I'm leaving this video here. Again, lengthy, so next time we'll probably make it shorter working on some side stuff if we can. Otherwise, it'll definitely be shorter regardless. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. If you liked it, make sure to push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a such suggestion for a Zelda game you'd like to see? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, want to check out what we've done prior to this? Click the link across my head here. Or this, the rest of the stops on this right will be in the top right hand corner. In the, tr the meantime, this trains off to its next destination, but we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye!